We are just a week out from Election Day, and this year there's a lot on the line in Virginia. That's right. Every single seat in the General Assembly is up for grabs. So before you head to the polls, we're sitting down with some of the candidates you'll see on the ballots. Yeah, we begin today with State Senator Bill DeSteff and his challenger, Missy Cotter Smazel. Both hoping to represent Virginia Beach in the 8th District. 13 News Now reporter Mike Gooding sat down with them both. As it so happens, the 8th Senate District of Virginia Beach is exactly where tragedy struck on May 31st when a gunman killed 12 people in a mass shooting. Now, the question of what we as a society should do about guns has taken center stage in the election. You've seen the commercials with Democrat Missy Cotter Smazel using images from the shooting and a soundbite from a survivor. And with Republican incumbent Bill DeSteff's ad calling Cotter Smazel shameful for bringing the subject up. For decades now, people have said it's not time to talk about it, it's not time to take action, and all we get are more mass shootings. But DeSteff says he's taken action on guns, written 27 bills, and had 13 of them passed, including, he says, one that tightens rules on sales at gun shows. One of them was a study that looked at mental health and the issues involving communities that had a tragedy like ours, looking at all of these communities to figure out what are the commonalities? Christopher Newport University political science professor Quentin Kidd says the DeSteff Cotter Smazel race is huge because of guns, and both parties will be watching how this contest turns out. One person sees this as a exploiting a tragedy, the other person sees it as um, we've got to deal with guns because the violence in this country is out of hand. Uh, voters will have the ultimate say um, on November 5th, and whatever that say is that voters have will have implications for the way campaigns are run across the country next year. Mike Gooding, 13 News Now.